Let's go over the signs and symptoms that the nurse may see in the newborn with neonatal sepsis. Common signs of sepsis in the newborn include temperature instability, hypotension, tachycardia, pale skin, central cyanosis, hypotonia, poor weight gain, poor feeding, irritability, persistent crying. The newborn may also develop a rash, gastrointestinal problems, seizures, jaundice, hypoglycemia, decreased oxygen saturation. The newborn may have drainage from the eyes or umbilical stump, lethargy or listlessness. The newborn may also display signs of respiratory distress syndrome. The biggest challenge neonatal sepsis poses to the nurse is that the symptoms are usually subtle or vague, but these newborns can deteriorate rapidly. So if the nurse sees any of these signs, they should notify the pediatrician right away. Because the clinical manifestations of neonatal sepsis could easily be confused with another condition, the presence of infection should be verified with a CBC, C-reactive protein, as well as blood, urine, or CSF cultures. The presence of infection could also be verified with x-rays of the chest or abdomen, which may reveal infectious microorganisms.